well, let's talk about this way. Because since Cassie and Diddy settled, and listen, keep in mind, there was the deadline. So obviously yeah. the deadline had a lot to do with it, but I think the high profile nature also has something to do with it. Harv Pierre, former president of Bad Boy, has been sued for mm-hmm. sexual assault. Axel Rose of Guns N' Roses. Marcel Swiley, who's a regular on my show, mm. he's denied it. Jamie Foxx, Cuba Gooding Jr., Jimmy Iovine, who's being sued by the same lawyer that Cassie was represented by. I'm, I'm not making any faces. I'm, I'm acting <laughs> like I don't even know who these people are. Mm. Bill Cosby, again. Photographer uh, Terry Richardson. NYC Mayor Eric Adams. And Diddy got two new lawsuits. Mm. Now, one of the lawsuits is actually interesting. One of the the two new lawsuits that Diddy actually got hit with. Because in one of the lawsuits, Diddy and Aaron Hall are being named. (laughs) Now, as some of you Vlad TV viewers may remember, I actually have an interview with Aaron Hall. Where in the interview, he's screaming about how Diddy has seen him have sex with a woman. A whole lot of niggas out there from Jamie Foxx to like <laughs> Denzel Washington to, yeah. to whoever. Everybody know me. Yeah. So sure everybody do. know if I say it, I'm a fucking to, to death. I yeah. like the fucking public. You feel me? Yeah. So niggas can't say nothing about it. Them square ass niggas, them precious cake little dick niggas. Yeah. I like for them <laughs> niggas to see how I fuck. Like if you speak yeah. to Joe to see or Puffy or any of them niggas, yeah. they've been at my house. They all see me fuck. They all know I'm a big nigga. And apparently this lawsuit kind of insinuates that that was the situation that the lawsuit is about. It was a whole, do you know what I'm talking about? The, the Aaron Hall video? I, you know, I, 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 I lost my whole cool when he said Aaron Hall because I know too much shit. <laughs> oh, he wanted this whole thing. No, Did yeah. he? Jonas, they all see me? Fuck. <laughs> they can't say my dick is small. Like, or something like this whole crazy tirade. Like Aaron Hall. Peanuts days. That's all I got to say. Peanuts days. What do you mean? There's a club. Oh, Peanuts. The club in L.A., man. You could have had a mini series called Peanuts Days. Okay. Boy, was that a wild. That's a wild. Now, oof, let me not say. Oof. Anyway. Yeah. So there's there's a lot going on. Um, mm. Like I said, there's an interview with Aaron Hall where he's he's not saying that he assaulted anyone, but he's saying that he's having sex in front of Diddy. In this in this interview, it's really more of a tirade than an interview. But that's not anything. What that's the gist of it? Like, yeah. But the woman claims that okay. they that that she met Diddy and Aaron Hall. And they went back to Aaron Hall's apartment, and mm. she was assaulted by both of them. Essentially, mm. um, listen. There's plenty of women out there that are down to have sex with you and your friend and his friend and your cousin and whatever else. Yeah, it's just is what it is. That. There was a lot. There was a lot of. There still is a lot of that. I yeah, mean, listen, no, I've, I've had situations where multiple people yeah. have had sex with females, and they're all down with it. Sometimes there's multiple females and whatever. Like it mm-hmm. just is what it is. You know, what I mean, no one's ever accused me of anything because I've never done anything. Mm-hmm. But it's kind of hard, like. It's, it's a weird situation because clearly there's probably a lot of assault mixed in there, but there's also a lot of money grabs. You know, I mean, Puffy's yeah. lawyer basically said that all these women are are scammers that are trying to get money. Some of them are, some of them aren't. Hard to say. Yeah, I think there's some, some truth to that because now you can get paid for that. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to paint it all on the same brush. Yeah, there's some people out there that was doing their thing and now all of a sudden they could be like, Oh, he he forced me to do this when that was like par for the course at one time. Uh, well, but but again, man, I don't man. The the tragedy is the legitimate, the legitimate um, people who are abused, the women who were drugged, that kind of shit. Yeah, that that kind of stuff is like, pff, man, that that I, that should not fly at all. 